We're in the, in the Midlands and we're on the A14 Improvement Scheme, which runs from Brampton all the way down to Cambridge. We're doing a, a, a bypass, a new A14. We're widening it from two lanes to three lanes and the, the existing road will stay open as well. There's a quite a lot of roadworks further down on the A14 itself, which will slow up the traffic for a while, but obviously in the long run it's going to improve things. We started using Topcon equipment going back probably seven or eight years ago. The drivers get on with it really quite well, it's quite easy to use. Um, we message them and now they, they've learned how to message us back so uh, they know when, when we're going to use it remotely and we're going to play around with their system, we'll tell them so they know if, if anything changes on their screen. If they need yeah. to activate the service or if they don't know how to select a line or choose an offset, I can then remotely access their screens on my desktop and change whatever they need to change and also delete and add um, different models to their screen so they never get mixed up or use an old revision by mistake. Sightlink is definitely in front of the other systems at the minute uh, for what it can produce with the, uh, the information we can feed into it and the live data we can get out of it. We can see uh, instantly where the machines are, uh, what program they're working on, what construction depths they're working to, which areas they're working in, so we know instantly if they're working on the right model and at the right level. In general, it's actually it's working really well. It saves a lot of time out from when you used to go out with a memory stick, put it in the machine, and then if it didn't work, you're back in, changing it again. Now, if we get a new revision to a model, change it in 10 minutes and the driver can have it before you've even left the office, so it's a lot quicker and a lot more simple. Sightlink makes my life easier because of its efficiencies, we've got the data links out there so we can send data from the office to the machines. And what else is important, and this is critical, is that we've got the people plant interfaces being reduced. As you can look behind us, you can see, or you can't see, that there's no people working the machines. And the quality of the uh, data going to the machines is always consistent. We've used 3D machine uh, on a number of sites before, uh, and then what we've done is we've asked our contractors to adopt this. Now Walters are taking it a step further and pushed it wider into their fleet and now we're starting to reap the benefits of that. Topcon has made innovation reality and 3D machine control is business as usual now. And you can see we've got this in the UK working business as normal.